All right, so tomorrow, Duval County Public Schools, you are out for the summer. St. John's and many of the other counties already out of there. A lot of students might be seeking employment opportunities to earn a little extra income. According to the U.S. Department of Labor, the youth labor force grows sharply between April and July every year, including students home from college for the summer. Gosh, I remember those little jobs. I would make good money, though, but it's kind of okay. like, what did I do with it? Who knows? So <laughs> Keith Mancy from First Florida Credit Union is with us this morning to help us talk more about this money. Um, you know, I get it. Kids want to do things, and, you know, parents shouldn't have to cover everything. So they, what is there, a formula maybe to spend some, save some? Yeah, I think the first step is to create a budget. Mm -hmm. I think we tell our, our young viewers, our old viewers, creating a budget is the best way to prioritize what you want to spend and what you want to save. If you're uh, comfortable with creating a budget, maybe think about what your expenses are coming up. You know, if you're a teenager, you might be looking forward to prom. Yeah. Or even past that, if you're looking to graduate from high school soon, you're going to be looking at college expenses and maybe vacation expenses after that. So those are two really important yeah. things to, to start looking at. What's the best way to kind of put that money aside? Because, I mean, I'm thinking... You know, you're not making a ton of money, and some of these accounts do have fees to them. So what, do you, what are your thoughts on as far as opening that maybe savings account? Absolutely. Well, at First Florida Credit Union, we offer a student checking account. Okay. It's for uh, 13 to 18-year-olds. It's $25 to open, and after that, there are no monthly fees at all. So okay. they can put their money in there, save as much as they like. They have a checking account as well, so they can use that money. Yeah. Uh, whenever they please, but you're still on the account as the parent. You're still on the account so you can monitor things, make sure they're making the right decisions with their money. And when you say $25, that's to open that's the account. That's just to open it's the not, account. You're Correct. not taking that money. It's still theirs. Correct. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, what are your thoughts, you know, kind of in that long-term spending and savings goal? Because especially with the little ones, my, my son thinks I make a million dollars every month, and I'm like, no, I don't. But he also likes to keep all his money in his wallet and not spend it. So how do you kind of have those conversations long-term? Well, if you're, if you're looking long-term, I think you need to really think about um, how you can save your money the most effective way possible. There are CDs that we offer. Mm -hmm. There are... Um, even retirement counts. I know it sounds really early to start talking about retirement, but the earlier you start saving in retirement, the better off you'll be in the future. You'll be thanking yourself. Even just shorter term goals, like you're a high schooler and you want to start saving for a house. Yeah. Sounds crazy, Maybe, right? Know, right? But it's a good you know, conversation. You're, you're yeah. going to sit there and thank yourself in 10, 15 years when you're going to buy that house. Yeah. You already have the down payment already saved. You know, the CDs right now, they're really high, right? I mean, to put your money away, you can get a good return right now. There, there are a lot of varying rates right now. And uh, the trend is, yes, they are. They are better than they were probably six months ago. Um, every place does have a different one. So if you're looking to get a CD, I would shop around. Okay. Comparison shop is yeah. the best route for that. All right. Um, and then do you have a camp this summer for the kids? Is that already sold out? But maybe something it, to think it about It is. Next it year? is fully booked this okay. year. It's called Camp CEO Chasing Economic Opportunity. Okay. We have 20 kids come to our County Road 210 branch and learn all of the financial basics from budgeting, credit, uh, credit scores, credit reports, yeah. and everything in between. It's a wonderful camp. And we open it to everyone. I know you said you have a little one. Uh, maybe next year they can come yeah, out and join be, us. He'll be 13 next year, so definitely, because it is hard to explain to him. Mommy does not make a million dollars a month, <laughs> <laughs> so you may not have that. All Absolutely. right, thank you for sharing with us and giving us that information. Visit firstflorida.org to learn more and make sure you consider that camp maybe for next summer. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for having me.